Hi, it's Greg Vincent here and welcome to Agent Time Saver. In this online training session, you'll discover the most powerful real estate agent time saver, guaranteed to help you become the agent who gets called into more listing opportunities automatically so you can enjoy more listings, more money and more time. So during this high impact session, we're going to talk about the fastest way to guarantee that you get called into a lot more listings. I'll also share three high powered time saver tools for real estate agents plus a simple way to leverage your time more effectively and generate automated leads super fast within 24 hours. So what is the number one time saver in real estate? Before we get to that, there are two important questions you should always ask, no matter who you're listening to, what webinar training you're doing, and those two questions are, who are you and what have you done? So I just wanna quickly share with you a bumper sticker around where I've come from and what's got me to here today. I'm a family man, I'm married with two teenage daughters, I've been in real estate for 20 plus years as a real estate principal, I had seven offices, we were under three different franchise groups plus also independent, we've dealt with residential, project marketing, commercial industrial, apartments, rural, property management, and then what I did was I went on to discover this online space. And in my quest to do that, I've personally visited over 2,000 real estate offices. I've also consulted to John McGrath, News Limited, real estate institutes, franchise groups, real estate trainers, and I've trained thousands of real estate agents across the country about social media and this online space. And I've gone from being arguably the most technophobic real estate agent in the country to now being seen as an industry authority. So enough about me, let's get on with this session. What is the number one time saver in real estate? You may think that it's automation or that it's leverage. The number one time saver in real estate is trust. Trust plays a massive role out there in generating business and getting called into listing presentations. You see, the best way that I've ever seen trust explained is by Zig Ziglar. He said, if people like you, they'll listen to you but if they trust you, they'll do business with you. And it's interesting when you look at trust, there's a thing they call the speed of trust. And when trust is low, it takes longer to do business. It takes longer to build a level of relationship and engagement with that particular consumer so that they'll then turn around and do business with you. And because of that time that it takes to build trust, it costs you money in marketing and brand recognition and all these different things that you've got to do to try to win over that person and build trust with that person. Whereas when trust is high, doing business with someone is really fast and it can cost you next to nothing to be able to get someone to become one of your customers when trust is high. And when trust is high, it's a lot faster and it's less expensive to do business. And when we look at the real estate industry, the Reader's Digest did a survey of the most trusted professions. And naturally the paramedics, firefighters, rescue volunteers, the nurses and pilots were in the top five. But then when you go down the list, we've got taxi drivers, CEOs, and then we've got real estate agents, and then underneath the real estate agents is sex workers, insurance salespeople, call center operators, door-to-door -door salespeople, and telemarketers. And yet, as real estate agents, we're down there at number 35, and then what a lot of agents do is they go to work each day and they do level 39 and level 40 activities, which isn't really helping you to build trust out there in your marketplace. So it's almost a backward strategy going out there doing this constant daily door knocking and cold calling. And the fact that real estate agents are distrusted by people, I see that as an absolute golden opportunity. You see, as real estate agents, we actually get given the keys to a person's home. When we're given the keys to a property, that seller bestows an incredible amount of trust in us. When you think about it, they don't give the keys out to their friends or even to their family, but they give the keys to their home to their real estate agent. So they have to trust the real estate agent to engage them 
to market their home. And this is where I see an absolutely golden opportunity for real estate agents who embrace the fact that we are distrusted and that trust is such an incredible time saver. You see, what's happened nowadays is that people are in a position where they're going online and the internet has actually provided the buffer that the consumer wants. Consumers and potential sellers are in a situation where they feel awkward or a little bit nervous and anxious about walking into a real estate office and meeting up with a real estate agent. Whereas with the internet, they can now go online and they can do all the research they need and do their agent selection via the web. And then once they find an agent they feel that they can trust or connect with over the internet, that's when they call them in. And I don't know, you probably already know this statistic if you've seen some of my training previously, but it's a vital statistic. Australian residential property sellers research their marketplace for an average 19 days prior to contacting an agent to conduct an appraisal. And the majority of this research is conducted via the internet. And in recent statistics that rolled out through realestate.com.au, 73% of sellers use the online to research when thinking about selling properties. And the vendors consider agents as the most useful resource for researching property values and selling tips. So if they're doing that research, then I see that there is this golden opportunity to build trust online. And by building trust online, you can then start to engage more and more people, you can leverage the internet so much more effectively and get called into a lot more listing presentations. Now, you may think, well, how can I build trust online? How do I do this? And I see that this is a golden opportunity because within the real estate industry, when you look at what's taught at real estate school, they don't tend to teach about marketing and strategy and this online space and how to market more effectively over the internet. And they definitely don't teach real estate agents how to build trust online. And yet it's such a vital component when you consider how much time your consumers and potential sellers are spending on the internet researching real estate agents. You see, trust is earned, it's not given. And yet I see a lot of real estate agents with their profiles out there saying, trust me, honesty, integrity, all those things that people would expect from you anyway. And a lot of agents have very similar profiles. And what I'm seeing in our industry is that there's a lot of copy and paste where agents have gone across to one agent's profile, they've copied the content there, pasted it on their own profile page, and then they wonder why people think that agents all seem to look the same. The thing with trust is trust must be demonstrated. And the best place to demonstrate trust is where the consumers are, where they're doing their research, when they're looking for a real estate agent. Which brings me to the first time saver tool. You see, the number one time saver tool is having a trustworthy digital footprint. Because people are doing so much research online now, it is vital that you have your own online profile set up correctly so that people can then engage with you and you start to build trust with them. You see, your digital footprint silently impacts on your results, your reputation and rapport building. It has a massive impact on whether you get called in or you don't. Over the past few years, I've caught up with Tom Panos quite a bit. And one of the questions that Tom asks in his training is, what version of yourself is here today? And I'd like to ask you that question as you're tuned into this online training session, what version of yourself is here today? Out of 10, are you a four out of 10, or are you an eight out of 10, or are you a 10 out of 10? and you're really pumped because you've just won a listing over your competitor, and then what happens on a day-to-day -day basis in a real estate office is that we tend to go from a 10 out of 10 to a four out of 10 because a sale crashes or something, and we go through from the heights of exhilaration to the depths of despair in the matter of minutes or hours. And so what happens, we go on this emotional roller coaster, and yet the question that's having a massive impact on your real estate results right now is this one. 
What version of yourself is online today? You see, out of 10, what I suggest you do is just grab a piece of paper and just write down, out of 10, what version of yourself is online today? Where are you online, out of 10? Are you a four out of 10? Are you a seven out of 10? Are you in a position where you feel that you've got your online profile set up so well that you are generating so many leads automatically online and you're getting called into lots of listings just because of your online digital footprint? So what number out of 10 are you currently? Because when you look at the average real estate agent works 50 plus hours per week and they're going through this emotional roller coaster ride. So there are 10 out of 10, and then a three out of 10, and an eight out of 10, five out of 10, constantly going up and down and up and down in attitude and focus. And yet, with the internet, the internet never sleeps. It works 24 seven, which means that it's working 168 hours a week. So the key is that you need to make the internet work for you. If you're currently working 50 hours a week and the internet's working 168 hours a week, if you can get the internet to work for you more effectively and get your online digital footprint set up so that it's a nine out of 10, it will constantly work for you at nine out of 10 for 168 hours a week. And you'll be able to then get called into a lot more listings, which then means you can actually turn around and you can work less once you've got your online profile working for you. So the number two time saver tool is maximizing your market reach. I love the fact that you can get one piece of content, whether it be a video or an article, and post it up onto the web, and that can then get shared out to my email database, out to my fans and friends on Facebook, my followers on Twitter, my subscribers on YouTube, I can get all of that out there and it can sit up on the web and it just sits there forever so people can see it all the time. It's amazing once you start to embrace this online space and this social media space, how much market reach you can get and how much extra leverage you can get in your time just because you've created one piece of content and posted up on the web. Your potential audience and market reach is larger than it was ever possible previously in any time in history. And it's the most powerful marketing platform that I've ever discovered. And the third time saver tool is automated lead generation. I love automated leads. Having it that people are in a position where they come to your website and they go in and register for your information. You see, what's happening now is that a lot of real estate agents' websites aren't converting. And I would say 99% of people who are entered into a real estate agent's database are manually entered in. Whereas having your website and your online profile set up the right way and making them convert so much better, you'll end up in a position where you'll get people who will actually register online and go straight into your database. And a lot of agents think that it's about getting people to subscribe to your newsletter. That's just one component to having subscribers and people registering into your database. You see, with social media now, if someone likes your Facebook fan page or subscribes to your YouTube channel or subscribes to your RSS feed on your blog or follows you on Twitter, it's all adding to your audience. It's all adding to your subscribers. It's all adding to your database. And the critical part is using tools that help you to convert online visitors into database leads. And while social media allows you to get people to follow you and like you and connect with you in those other platforms, one thing that is vitally important to your online marketing is understanding how people use the internet and why they go on the internet. You see, the number one reason why people go onto the internet isn't to search for information like you may think. The number one reason why people go onto the internet is to check their email. You see, you can't check your email until you actually go onto the internet, which is why email marketing is still vitally important. And email data capture is absolutely critical. 
And that's why having a high converting automated lead capture platform working for you around the clock is going to help you to generate more leads that automatically go into your database. You see, there's a high converting platform that I'm sharing with my real estate agents and email opt-in rate is increased by approximately 38% just from one particular strategy. And this is just one of the ways that you can use this particular platform. You see, this is a property seller's resource guide and website visitors come across this page and this is what they call a two-step opt-in and it's designed this way to increase conversion because people come to this particular web page and they click on the play button or they click on the button and when they click on the button a registration form drops in so they don't go across to another website it all happens on the same page where they enter in their first name and their email address to get access to the resource guide. So it could either be a resource guide or it could be some sort of download, whether it be an ebook or an, or an audio series or a video series, whatever you like. But we've set it up as a resource guide because what this allows us to do is it allows us to get it up onto the web very, very quickly. And it doesn't just have to be for sellers. It can be for investors. We've got one for buyers as well. So if you're in need of buyers, you can set up this type of page as well. And the beauty of it is that you can start capturing leads in less than 24 hours. This is the simplest platform that I've ever seen for setting up lead capture pages. And once you've got it set up, it's what I call set and forget. It works around the clock for you 24 seven. So if you're really interested in capturing leads, but also saving time, then the ultimate time saver in today's marketplace is unlocking the power of the web, harnessing the power of the web, getting the internet to work for you, to generate automated leads, and to make sure that you're the agent who gets called in. And I know that the internet, from a real estate agent's perspective, can be a little bit confusing. You sort of look at the internet maze and think, where do I start? What's the first step? Which way do I head? What strategy is the best one? And which is going to help me to get there faster? You see, I know when you go onto the internet to try to find the information, it's like taking a drink from a fire hydrant, which is why what we've done is we've put together a seven step automated million dollar roadmap because I've found that a lot of agents understand they need to use the internet more effectively. And I also understand that going through that maze is way too confusing and way too time consuming. And I understand that you simply want the fastest, easiest, most inexpensive accelerators that fast track the automated leads and create your ultimate attraction agent positioning. So you're getting automated leads and you're getting called in to listing presentations which is why what we've done is we've also put together some done for you strategies that allows you to generate leads into your business really quickly. You see, I went out and I embarked on the journey to discover how the internet ticks and to see if I could find that one thing that changes everything. And the great news is that I found it and it's a major real estate marketing breakthrough. So if you'd like to find out more about this breakthrough and how you can set up those automated lead generation pages and how to save so much time as a real estate agent and get called into more listings, then what I suggest you do is head on over to gregvincent.com.au forward slash breakthrough and that's where I'll share the insights into that one thing that I've found that will help you to get called into a lot more listing presentations. Remember that number one time saver tool is building your trustworthy digital footprint. The sooner you can get the internet working for you around the clock, the more listings you'll get, the more money you'll make, and the more time you'll have. You see, I've done so much research into this to save you so much time so that you can just implement these things into your business. For example, 
I can show you just one strategy, one quick, simple tip that can help you to increase your online conversion rate over the internet by approximately 40%. So if you'd like to be part of this online revolution, then head on over to check out the breakthrough because like my mate Peter Brewer says, real estate agents won't be replaced by technology, but they will be replaced by agents who effectively use technology. And that's why it's absolutely vital that you make sure that you are future proof, that you own tomorrow in your marketplace. Where you are today currently is because of all of your previous actions and decisions that you've made up till now. And if you want to move forward to the fast track and to be seen as an innovator out there in your marketplace, then go across to gregvincent.com.au forward slash breakthrough and I'll look forward to catching up with you on the other side.